Man United has been told that a disruptive delay in the completion of their takeover might last up to 10 weeks. Since November of last year, the Red Devils have been for sale. The Glazer family announced that they will evaluate all options at the moment. The strength of Manchester United rests on the passion and loyalty of our global community of 1.1 billion fans and followers, the statement from the Glazers read. As we seek to continue building on the club's history of success, the board has authorised a thorough evaluation of strategic alternatives. We will evaluate all options to ensure that we best serve our fans and that Manchester United maximises the significant growth opportunities available to the club today and in the future. Throughout this process, we will remain fully focused on serving the best interests of our fans, shareholders and various stakeholders. Since the deadline was set for last Friday, the third and final round of bidding has already occurred. Several potential minority investors expressed interest in the Glazer family, but Sheikh Jassim and Sir Jim Ratcliffe are the front runners to take over as the club's majority owners. The proposal made by Sheikh Jassim is all or nothing since he wants complete control over the football team. Ratcliffe, who will take over as the company's largest stakeholder, has been willing to make a compromise and give the Glazers a 20% ownership. Ratcliffe reportedly made the highest bid at Full Man United, but Sheikh Jassim was bemused by this. The Daily Telegraph has published an article that revealed. The Sheikh Jassim camp is certain that their offer of further cash investment to fund the renovation of Old Trafford and the club's training facility is in addition to their offering to the Glazers and they are perplexed by any assertions to the contrary, according to sources close to the Sheikh Jassim camp. The Glazers had been holding out for around £6 billion but none of the bidders have got to that level and the Qataris believe their offer is the best for the club, fans and community. A new report from Football Insider's Adam Williams claims the Man United takeover could take up to 10 weeks to complete once a preferred bidder is selected. To assume that the process could be formally concluded by the time the transfer window opens in early June is deemed unrealistic. The report continues. While the winner may be announced in the coming weeks, a source in the industry has told this website that the actual transfer of power will almost certainly take longer. That view is shared by several leading minority shareholders in United. The circa 10-week delay could prove disruptive both in the transfer and commercial departments. Do you think this will disrupt Ten Hag's summer plans and limit him with the players he can bring in? Leave your comments below.